right, we're here for day two. As you can see, it's pretty windy today, uh, so casting has been a challenge. Uh, we've already got a couple fish. Uh, we've got uh, one on the trout spay, one on the single hand rod. Um, weather looks awesome. It's gonna be, it's get a little warmer. It was pretty cold this morning, but um, we're here for it. Uh, we're gonna get some nice fish today, I know it. All right, so stick with us. So there's this ledge out here that's really cool. Um, it drops off pretty quick. It goes from like, you can see here, like inches to about 15 feet. And it's just so fishy looking. I caught some fish here yesterday. We've got a couple here already. I don't know if you can see there, but it just drops right off into the abyss. So dragging this balance lead, balance leech up this ledge should be irresistible for a trout. We're gonna try to work in the wind the best we can with our trout spay rod here. Good thing is though, you don't have to cast real far here. This is a, there's a little creek, or if you can see over there, there's a little creek coming in. So the thing with these cutthroats is um, they're staging up here to spawn. They're looking for inlet creeks. They spawn in like April. So it's getting towards the end of February now. So they're putting on putting on some weight for the spawn. Makes them real aggressive. That's why you want to target them this time of year. Ooh, I got a good casting window here. Let the wind die a bit. Yeah, that's the best cast I've done in a while. All right, we're gonna let that one sink quite a bit, quite a bit here. You want to get it all the way up to the ledge because a lot of times that's where they'll hit it, just when it's kind of creeping up. They think it's gonna get away, so I'm stripping in my whole gadget head here. I'm gonna give it a little, a couple extra jigs. like a nice fish oh man look at him in that water so pretty that's a cool looking one look at him he looks like a steelhead almost look at that tummy Oh, covered in spots. Excellent fish. There he is. That was fun. All right, we are hooked up again. Nice one. Just turned the camera off. And that's when he hit. Nice and colored up. Yeah, he hit it and then dropped it and then came back for it. Come on, come in. Okay, here we go. All right, there he is. Get a good look at him. Just a beauty. Beauty Lahontan. All right, see you, buddy. Oh, there's no one. Oh, I missed him. There you go, now you got one. All right, Jay. Nice.
So you let cruise through and then you won't get any hits for a while, then another pot will cruise through. Oh, oh there's one. Hooked up. Yeah. He's a splashy one. That one's fighting pretty good. Yeah. He's pulling. He's pulling on the line. Yes. Dang, he's really pulling line. I'm surprised. This is the best fighting one I've got. This is not the biggest one. It's the it's fighting like crazy. Yeah, this one. Pretty impressed with it. Dang, he's not even joking. <laughs> Unreal. Come on. All right, I think he's done now. Maybe. All right, in the net. There he is. Well, this is fun. <laughs> Seriously. See how many fish this uh, balanced leech, leech can hold up to. All right, here comes fish. Oh, there's one. That one's got a bit bigger head shakes. Oh yeah, that's a good fish. Big one. Yeah. That one's a hog. Yeah, he's not happy, huh? <laughs> yeah, I think that might be the. I think that might be about the same, maybe like 18, 19 inch kind of class. He's decided to go back out. Yeah, he's going out. All right, I think you're done now, buddy. Just a gorgeous fish. Come on in. He's not having it. Oh, so close. He saw the net, now he's like, nope. Oh, I got him. Eh, no, he's probably 18, 19. Heck of a fish, though. Inhaled it. Yeah, that's a really nice fish. Heck yes. All right. All right. Oh, hit him again. Oh, he's on there. He came back. That's the second one that's come back for it after I put a hook in him. When they hit it, they just stop it. So it's like, it feels like a rock. But yeah, set on anything that you think is not just water. That's a good one too. I've been strip setting too. Oh, get 
in that tire. That's a big old cutty. Flies out. Let's have a look. Whoa, he's croaking. That's a beauty. Those spots. Oh man, this is so fun. This, oh, he probably broke me off. Bastard. The first half of day two was just nothing short of surreal. Uh, we still have the evening bite ahead, so please subscribe for that. The link for day one is above, and I'm just so happy I was able to share this with y'all. Tight lines.